it's Sephora haul. Yay! I'm super excited. I finally get to share all the products that I got during the sale as well as I picked up some products from Beautylish and Amega Forever. But let's go ahead and get into the video. But hello, how are you? I hope that you guys are having an amazing day today. If you're new to my channel, my name is Jarell. And if you guys have been here for a little while, thank you so much for being here again. So let's go ahead and get into the haul. I'm going to start with Sephora first just because I'm pretty sure that that is the reason why you guys are here. So I'm going to just put everything on my table because otherwise it's going to drive you and me crazy. First product that I got is from Fenty Beauty and I think that everybody that I watched got this a trio right here. It's just because it is amazing. I absolutely love a Fenty Beauty glosses. They are just the best. They last the longest on my lips and they just look so glossy and juicy and just the, the, the best. This one right here is the heat so it is a little Little bit more on the plumpy side this one is the cream it does give you a really nice opacity to it and it's more on the pinky side and it is called cupcaking and this one is just the regular gloss but look how gorgeous that is i mean that color is just so 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 beautiful and it is called fuchsia flex so i can't wait to actually open these up and, and try it for you guys in a future video the next product that i got is from tatcha and it is a skincare this is the essence water and this one has been on my love list for a very very long time so let me go ahead and just open it i always have the essence waters either from coralise or now that i'm trying tatcha but i definitely need to have some kind of liquid before i go in with my serums and that is the way that i do my skincare at nighttime and this bottle looks absolutely luxurious really nice and beautiful i'm really excited to incorporate this essence water into my skincare routine and of course it's going to be tonight so i went ahead and got the gucci primer this is very expensive for being a primer but i think that is so so important for you to prep your skin the right way and to have the right primer especially if you are oily to combination and like me a primer is a must for me and i have been loving the tasha primer as well as the glow wish from huda beauty but i needed something new and this one has been again on my love list for such a long time and i'm like you know what that's it i'm going to get it i'm really excited i hear nothing but great things about it so i'm really looking forward to trying that primer another product that i got is the makeup by mario eyeshadow palette and this is the ethereal eyes that is what i have on my eyes right now i created three more looks for you guys i did a whole entire review on this palette already i will link that video down below as well but this palette is currently sold out online if you can go to your sephora or call them and find out if they still have it available you won't regret it this palette is absolutely beautiful if you guys want to see swatches inspirations again i will link that video down below i restocked myself with the benefit precisely my brow and i do have the shade in six i absolutely love this one just because my hair is super dark so i really need to have the right brow pencil just so it doesn't turn red or too like warm on me and this in zero six is a perfect for my brows i wanted to try the new mascara from uh um, Tower 28 everyone has been raving about this mascara I'm always looking to try new mascaras just because I have been really stepping away from wearing false lashes and I wanted something that is going to give me the length of like you know like I'm wearing falsies <laughs> so I'm hoping that this is going to be it Let's, let me just open it up because I actually want to see the tube okay so it is the same as of the box I'm really really looking forward to trying this foundation I'm going to do a video using all of these products so stay tuned for that and subscribe just in case you have not already I also went ahead and restock myself on this product that I have not had in my collection for a very long time just because I kind of ran out of it and I just didn't want to pick it up again this one is the 24 hour brow setter and this is the mini one and this is what it looks like super cute i don't want a full size just because i already have so many other brow products but i know this one from benefit is so good and i know that it's going to last me for a very long time just because again i have it on rotation i also got the milk makeup concealer Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. I remember loving, loving one of their concealers in the, like with the white cap, um, but 
the packaging was just so horrible so I never repurchased that again and now that they have come out with this new concealer I was really excited to try it again just because I really enjoy that one the formula was just so flexible so nice and hydrating so that is always something that I am looking to have this one is in the shade 10 and I think it's going to be the perfect shade for me it does have a little bit more of a peachy undertone which is good to cancel out my dark circles a little bit goes a long way yeah I think this shade is definitely going to work for me Next, we have the Giorgio Armani, and this is the Luminous Silk Glow Fusion Powder. This is how the packaging looks like. Amazing. It is now round. It has like a really interesting shape. It is a magnetic closure. It has a mirror, and I have been wanting this powder for a very long time. I think it's going to work out for me just fine. I'm really excited to try this one, and it really helps out when you get a little bit of a discount. So I was waiting for this sale so I can purchase all of these products. The last product that I got from Sephora is from YSL. And again, I've never tried anything from YSL before. And I decided to buy a lipstick just because I can see myself using this. I don't know about the shade though. Hmm. All right, I'm going to swatch it. Oh yeah. Okay, so that is really beautiful. It's definitely not a shade that I can see myself using over and over again. I'm pretty sure that I actually purchased a nude shade just because those are my kind of go-to shades. So I don't know if I press the wrong button or they send me the wrong shade. I'm going to double check just because again, I don't see myself reaching for this color over and over again and I wanted something that I can use a lot, especially if I'm going to be paying you know, YSL prices. So yeah, I'm going to definitely double check on the shade just because I remember being a little bit more nudie. So I will double check on that. So those are all the products that I got from Sephora. Let's go ahead and talk about the next products that I purchased from Beautylish and Makeup Forever. Make so Makeup Forever had a sale for 30% discount. And of course, when I saw it, I had to purchase this one. This one has been on my list, like on my mind for a very long time. And I have been waiting for a really good sale. 30% off, it was just amazing. So I'm like, okay, let me go ahead and get it. You get a foundation, concealer, blushes, contour shades, bronzers, everything in here. Let me know in the comment section down below if you guys want to see this palette in action because I would love to try for you guys and like maybe do a wear test or something like that. So the last products that I'm going to share with you are from Beautylish and I decided to get two palettes from Viseart. This one is one of the newer little super tiny petite palettes. I absolutely love this ones, especially for traveling. They are just great and this color story is just so beautiful. I fell in love with this shade right here and this Toby one as well and I think that it's a little bit different and again for traveling it's just really really nice and I also got a, this one right here which again is a new to their line and this is the color story if you are into purples then you are going to really enjoy this one this, these colors look a perfect for fall so I'm really excited to try this one so out of the two this one right here is definitely calling my eye like I love colors like this I think that they are just super beautiful really really gorgeous with my purchase they gifted me an eyeshadow primer which is good because i've been using my p louise one for a very long time so you know gotta change it up and i also purchased two lip liners from anastasia Beverly hills we have deep taupe and a cool brown i don't know how different they are from one another but let's go ahead and see Okay, so this one right here, which is deep taupe, is a little bit more on the pinky side. This one right here, cool brown, is definitely more on the brownie side. So they are very different from one another. So here we have a deep taupe, this one right here, and this one is cool brown. But that is it, guys. That is it for this video. That is it for the haul. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for your love, your time, and support. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel if you have not already, and I will see you next time.